Okay, Jamie, I've got a um, visit to go and do, if that's okay. Um, it's a gentleman in Bracknell. His wife's just phoned. She thinks he's in pain and he's quite unsettled at the moment. So she'd just like us to go and see what we think when we get there. Um, he has got some injectable medications there as well. So are you happy to go and assess and see what you think? Um, yeah, of course. I'll just print his details off for you and then you can head out. Okay? Thank you, George. No problem. The main driver for this service has to be to enable people who are dying or have a palliative care need to be cared for where they want to be cared for. Sometimes it's just knowing there's a friendly voice on the ends of the phone uh, to ask advice from. Uh, they don't feel silly because overnight, three o'clock in the morning, it's a very lonely place to be. So we're off to see a patient and their family in an area called Bracknell in East Berkshire. So I'm just putting the equipment in the boot and we'll make our way shortly. So I've been a nurse now for approximately four years, qualified at university and obtained my degree there. First of all, I worked in a ward environment in the acute sector in trauma and then I became a scrub nurse after that. However, life changed and um, I now found myself in palliative care, an area that I'm very interested in and I've been doing that for about one year. What I like about the job is my ability to be, my ability to be autonomous, um, have the ability to make decisions myself, but there's always support on the other end of the phone so I can speak to a specialist. The shifts are obviously 12 hours long, but that I believe allows flexibility because you're more likely to have more days off, which means you can spend time with your family or you can do hobbies as you wish. We just arrived at our patient's home in Bracknell um, and I'm just getting some relevant equipment out of the boot. Very pleased with how it went. The patient was in discomfort, so we had to give some medication. Um, we gave some morphine, helped them settle a lot, and we were able to support the family, reassure them, which in turn meant that patient didn't have to go to hospital. Um, they were best cared for at home and they can now stay at home and they can call us again if they need us. There's so much training available. Uh, we can go to conferences. Uh, there's so much room for progression, which is great. Um, just like working in the NHS within our hospital setting. So loads of opportunities and it enables nurses to do their continued professional development to meet the NMC standards. I don't even know if I can put this into words, how um, exceptional this team is and what it means to patients. The relief that patients and families feel when we turn up. Cheers. <laughs>